new bike lanes on Glenwood Avenue in Minneapolis have some people who live along that corridor upset. The county put the lanes in along Glenwood Avenue from 94 all the way to Theodore Worth Park. Hennepin County officials say that the new bike lanes make sense to help connect bicyclists to downtown and regional bike paths. But as Red Chapman reports, some say it's the process of developing the new bike lanes that has them upset. For 33 years, Maiska Woolley and her neighbors along Glenwood Avenue have parked in front of their homes. He didn't know it was going to happen. She says no one knew a construction project would take away their parking to make room for a bike lane. The process was totally undemocratic. There was no due process done. Maiska says county and city officials tried to put bike lanes along Glenwood Avenue several years back. We cut leaflets, and so neighbor, uh, all the residents uh, organized themselves, and we pointed out all the people. At that time, Maiska says the idea of new bike lanes was put off until later because of their input. You had to go and park several blocks away, carry your groceries, carry your kids. You have friends and neighbors, uh, well, friends and family coming and no place to park. Right. Hennepin to County Bike and Pedestrian Coordinator Jordan Kosak says the new bike lanes help improve the corridor. Formerly, there was a bike lane on one side of the road, but not the other. And um, that actually created, I think, some conflicts with uh, vehicle and bike um, bicyclists having to share the same lane of traffic. So in a lot of ways, what we're trying to do is make a more consistent experience. He says the county met with the Harrison Neighborhood Association, business owners and community stakeholders who all approved the plan. He said, well, the neighborhood okayed it, that they had done this, you know, to, they, they invited people. And I thought, well, how the heck did we miss that? Rich Chapman, WCCO 4 News. Hennepin County says it takes community engagement very seriously and tries to coordinate that input in every project. COSEC says that the county is continuously working to improve and be more comprehensive when making change in neighborhoods.